Have you ever wondered about an electric van? Well, if it was a dream that you have been dreaming of for a while, then Tesla is about to make this dream a reality. Tesla has been considering making an electric van or minibus for some years. CEO Elon Musk discussed two new segments Tesla is trying to electrify in Tesla Master Plan Part 2. Aside from consumer automobiles, two other electric vehicles are required – heavy-duty trucks and high-density urban transportation. Both are still in the early stages of development at Tesla and are expected to be unveiled next year. We believe the Tesla Semi will significantly reduce the cost of cargo transportation while also improving safety and making it a lot of fun to drive. Tesla eventually announced the Tesla Semi, a heavy-duty truck but no vehicle for high-passenger density urban transportation. Musk has mentioned developing an electric minibus based on the Model X, but it never materialized. There were rumors that Tesla would build a van-like passenger car for Musk's boring company, but the tunnel-building business has instead relied on existing Tesla vehicles. Musk also stated in 2018 that working with Mercedes-Benz on an electric version of their iconic and adaptable Sprinter van would be fascinating, but the corporation never materialized. Musk was asked about developing an electric van during a conference call following the release of Tesla's quarter 4 2020 earnings in January 2021. Following several recent announcements from other firms entering this space, such as GM with Brightdrop, Tesla will build an electric van, according to the CEO, but it'll be contingent on battery cell supply. I think Tesla is definitely going to make an electric van at some point. So the thing to bear in mind is that there is fundamentally a constraint on battery cell output. If one is not involved in manufacturing, it's really hard to appreciate just how hard the scale of production is. It's the hardest thing in the world. Prototypes are easy, scaling production is very hard. During the call, the manufacturer also stated that the Tesla Semi program is experiencing a similar shortage of battery cells. While increasing their own battery cell production would help, Musk has stated that Tesla will purchase all of the battery cell supplies available from other manufacturers. So what has changed since then? Well, the short answer is a lot. Tesla has made their perfect 4860 cells and now they have enough batteries to make these cars. The battery was the major problem and with the 4680 cells, the problem is now somewhat solved. I'm not saying that problem is entirely solved, but we're at least halfway through it. It's still too early to say anything about the van, but we will probably be able to see the Tesla van by the end of 2023. It's still just speculation, but I hope that this speculation hits right on target.